Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing great today. Uh, today we are back in Mass Effect 3 and we just dealt with Kai Leng, which is amazing. But that means that we <laughs> we now need to deal with the Reapers, which is not quite as amazing, but uh, a long time coming. So I think I am just going to try to take it all the way to conclusion this time. I don't know how long it's going to take, so maybe it's not going to work out by the end of it, but um, I'm going to give it an honest try, so we'll see. I have a feeling that I just won't be able to stop in the middle of the mission, and that's kind of why I'm doing it for the most part, but we'll see. If it ends up being a five hour long video, of course, it's not going to get released as is, so... Anyway, without further ado, let's go save the Earth. Alright, so last time we left off, I left all the conversations with my companions to take care of in this video, so uh, let's go do that. I think I talked to Trainer, though. Commander? I did. So let's do the rounds, and then we can keep going. Hello, guys. The Normandy is ready, Shepard. All systems are armed, all ammunition is loaded, all reloads have been manufactured. Thruster fuel is at maximum. Cyber warfare suites have evolved in ways that would be computationally impossible to predict. I have also kissed Joker for luck. That's appropriate. How's your focus, Edie? Any big questions? No. Any small questions? No. Any lingering issues? About what? An imperfect designer who could be seen as a warped father figure, maybe? Definitely not. Did something prompt this line of questioning? I've just learned you have to ask about these things. The Normandy is ready, Shepard. All right, Joker, what are you going to say? Oh, drinking on the job. I can understand. Considering the circumstances. Prime all those years ago, with that Tory inspector watching us. Nihilus. Yeah, I told you that mission was going to be bigger than we thought. <laughs> yep. I think you can mark that prediction down as accurate. And now we're heading back to Earth. Is this mission going to be bigger than we thought too? Man, I hope not. A nice routine delivery run would be fine with me. It's been an honor, Commander. Same here, Joker. I don't know how it's gonna end, but whatever happens. What do you mean, whatever happens? Everyone knows what's gonna happen. You're gonna kick some Reaper ass. That's what you do. And I'll be flying you there in style. I respect your faith in me. Commander. Oh, we're gonna cry today. Hey, Cortez. With you till the end, Shepard. Wow. Ready when you need me. Vega, what you up to? Sticking it to that bastard Kai Leng must have felt good. It certainly really? did. Just wish we'd have caught up to the elusive man before he could screw us over again. You and me both. Well, at least we get to head back to Earth. I've been asking for it. I just hope I'm gonna make those Reapers pay. For everything they've done. Hey. Here's to hoping. Breaking now, Alliance Marines uncover the worst Cerberus war crimes to date. Sanctuary, advertised as a safe haven on the planet Horizon, exposed as a secret Cerberus lab. Brainwashing, lethal experiments, and Reaper connections, the exclusive details next in the battle space. I haven't talked to her in a long time. You all right? Come on, I can't. All right? There we go. On a colony, kid Shepard, Beckenstein. It was right next door to the Citadel. Was? Was. <sighs> I'm sorry. The Reapers didn't even land on it to harvest. Just took a few shots from space. You know, because the Reapers hit industrial centers. And we have factories that make binoculars. Had 
factories. We're gonna beat them. Yeah. Hey, Javik. I am prepared for whatever lies ahead, Commander. The Reapers have haunted the galaxy long enough. It is time to end the nightmare. The deaths of my soldiers will be avenged. The events of the Cronian Nebula will not have been in vain. The last Prothean awaits your command. There was no final battle against the Reapers in my cycle. A great moment lies before you, Commander. Hey, guys. The Normandy is ready to go, Commander. Give the word and we'll get you to Earth. And Commander, it's been such an honor to be a part of the team. Likewise, Gabby. Good luck, and be careful, okay? Yes, ma'am. To believe that Tim only sent these two to sweeten Shepard? Good luck with the assault. Wish I was joining you. No, you don't. I've seen you shoot. <laughs> Fine. Then I wish I could shoot better. Then I wish I was joining you. Take care, Shepard. You too, Donnelly. Commander, the Normandy is as ready as she'll ever be. That goes double for my team. We're prepared for whatever hits us. And Commander, whatever happens today, it has been an honor and privilege to serve with you. The honor's been mine, Adams. Give them hell, ma'am. Quite a somber conversation Normandy with everyone. Ready. Just give the order. Where is Tali? She's not here at all, isn't she? Okay. <sighs> all right. Hey, Caden. Hey, Shepard. That was rough. Glad everyone got out of there. Ready to head home? Home. Back to Earth. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm ready. About time. About freaking time. And if the Reapers mess with anything I left behind, I'm gonna be so pissed. See you topside, Shepard. Hey, Shepard. Yep. Can't imagine anyone is in the lounge. Nope. Hey, Dr. Chakwas. You've come a long way since those days under Captain Anderson. It has been my great honor to be with you through this journey. I'm proud of you. Thank you, Doctor. Goodbye, Shepard. And good luck. Ominous much? You've come a long way since those days under Captain Anderson. It has been my great honor to be with you through this journey. I'm proud of you. Thank you, Doctor. The private messages terminal has new correspondence. Does it? Email from Captain Reynolds to Miranda Lawson. Mrs. Lawson, or Miss Lawson. Uh, the Alliance wishes to express its gratitude for your assistance. With the information you've been sending us on Cerberus, we've been able to avoid ambushes there w they were setting up for our supply convoys. We'd offer you additional resources, but I understand you've procured a Class F private fighter and joined up with former colleagues. I also understand that several Cerberus bases were lost after being attacked by a reported group of private special operatives of no known affiliation. The Alliance cannot officially condone this kind of independent operation, nor do we actually confirm that these operations are taking place. Good luck, Miss Lawson. How you holding up, Liara? Nervous. Frightened. Anxious to go. But glad I'm here. And I'm ready whenever you're ready, Shepard. In fact, I think I've checked my equipment three times. Seven times, Dr. Tassoni. Stop me if I try for eight. I know how that goes. We can do this, Shepard. We can do this, Shepard. You're still hoping. I don't have any... any more here, no? Okay, don't. Okay. Shepard. We were just saying goodbye. And making friendly wagers. Optimistic wagers, in your case. A Turian military operative competing with a Corian mechanic, and I'm the optimistic one. Do you remember Ilos? Yes, 
It was filled with geth, which tilted the odds in your favor. Excuses, excuses. I doubt you'll be hacking any synthetics this time. I still have the shotgun. I'll be sure to let a few Reaper forces get close enough for you to use it. Thanks. Of course, if they get past me, they'll be right on top of you. That's what the armor's for. <laughs> They're saying goodbye. Oof. You two have been with me longer than most. You believed in me when nobody else did. Thanks. Kila Salai, Shepard. Well, you did give me some incentive. Kila Salai, Tali. Kila Salai, Shepard. At least we finally killed Lieutenant Bastard Kai Lang. I just hope we get to do the same to his general. It's kind of amazing how everything's come full circle. The Citadel's been the center of galactic civilization, a reaper trap, and my source of employment for a long time. And now it's our salvation for any chance at winning this war. I think it's time we got you back home, Shepard. Earth will either be remembered as the place we beat the Reapers, or it'll be a smoking ruin for the next cycle to wonder about. I appreciate the Lieutenant Bastard. Not right now. Not right now. Okay. Fine. Um, I think it's time. Well, here it is. Got a priority message from Admiral Hackett requesting to come aboard. Permission granted. Aye, Commander. Commander? Admiral? Are you ready to bring the might of the galaxy to bear on the Reapers? Yes, sir. Then let's make sure the fleets are ready. All fleets reporting in, sir. Never before have so many come together from all quarters of the galaxy. But never before have we faced an enemy such as this. The Reapers will show us no mercy. We must give them no quarter. They will terrorize our populations. We must stand fast in the face of that terror. They will advance until our last city falls. But we will not fall. We will prevail. Each of us will be defined by our actions in the coming battle. Stand fast. Stand strong. Stand together. Pack it out. Shepard, the sword fleets are ready to strike at the Reapers surrounding Earth. While they keep the enemy engaged, you and Hammer Ground Forces can take London. London? Why aren't we hitting the Citadel directly? Anderson can brief you on that. Um... Admiral, how are you holding up? We're ready to end this. But as you can see, the station's closed itself since it appeared over London. That's right. Damn it. Gotta get the arms open the to bullet. the Crucible. Exactly. But London is surrounded by Hades cannons. Hammer transports can't land while they're active. You lead a squadron of smaller shuttles. Infiltrate with a ground team to take out the cannons using heavy weapons. Hammer can land, and we'll set up a forward operation space. I still don't see how we're getting to the Citadel from London. The Reapers use this beam to transport humans, alive and dead, to the Citadel. From the FOB, Hammer will launch an all-out assault on the Citadel beam. Everyone who makes it that far will take the beam to the Citadel, then locate and activate the Citadel arm controls. Once we see those arms, Shield Fleet will escort the Crucible to the Citadel. But timing will be critical. We don't have enough firepower to keep the Crucible safe for long. Wait. Escort the Crucible to the Citadel? I'm 
must have misunderstood the wording. Nothing's ever easy. No reason it should start now. It's desperate. I don't even want to guess at our odds. But... But this is the only plan we have. If we wait, the Reapers bleed us slowly. Conventionally, we can't defeat the Reapers without the Crucible. Get the Citadel arms open. Commander, whatever the cost, we'll do the rest. Okay, yes, sir. Good luck to all of us. Oh, okay. I guess we should go for the people we are most familiar with. Because I'm probably, rightfully so, assuming that is going to be a very tough battle. Okay, so. There is one weapon that I wanted to try. And to be honest, I don't even know if I'm going to end up using it because I barely use the heavy pistol, but, but, it might make more sense if there's a lot of people we need to deal with that an assault rifle might, might be slightly better. So let's see. I think it's the last one here. Yeah, the, the M7 Lancer. So let's mod that guy. Let's see. There's... It's pretty heavy. Where's the weight mod that I had? There we go. Oh, barely. Okay. Maybe there's... I could have upgraded that. Maybe I could have, but... We're not there anymore. But, you know... 8% is more than nothing. Let's see. Um, so fire rate is good. Damage is meh. So maybe we can up that. But this is also nice. Slot occupied? Oh, interesting. Stability. Okay, maybe we'll just go with this then, since that slot is occupied. But that increased our weight. God damn it. Never mind, we can't go with this one. So the only other one that we have is this guy. Damaged by 20%. So let's let's just go with this. Alright. Back. I'm still below 50%, so that's probably okay. You guys are fine. Yeah. Although, maybe he shouldn't have this. Maybe he should have this guy too. Maybe? No, he doesn't really care about capacity. Nor does he care about weight, to be honest. So maybe I can put in that other... No, oh, it's got pretty low accuracy compared to Maddock. I don't know. Sure, let's let's give it a go. I mean, what do we gotta lose, right? Maybe we'll give him a scope for accuracy. <laughs> uh, damage... What was that, this last one? Yeah, we could do this. So it's Pierce. And he doesn't give a shit about weight, so let's confirm that. Here we go! Approaching Soul Relay, Commander. We're through the relay in 30 seconds. Should we strap in? I guess not.
Alliance fleet reporting. Turian fleet reporting. Asari fleet's reporting. What are those balls? The Death Stars? Quarian fleet's accounted for and ready. Death fleet reporting. All fleets reporting in, Commander. Ready to engage on your command. There's so many. This is it, everyone. Be ready on my signal. Fire! To be clear, I'm not crying because I'm sad yet, and just overwhelmed by all of this. Breaking off. Preparing for descent. Shit. Oh my god. Shepard. Good luck. You too, Joker. Oh, let's do this, guys. Stay safe. I'll be back before you know it. I'll hold you to that. Normandy out. We're closing in on the LZ, Commander. How's it look? Like hell? <laughs> Take a look for yourself. I bet. I'm sorry, Shepard. I know how you must feel. Barely even recognize it. I've never been to London. Shit, we got a lock. Hold on. Oh, God. Damn it. Status. That was the squad responsible for taking out that defense turret. Who's on it now? Nobody in the vicinity. All either deployed or shot down. Drop us off. Ma'am? <laughs> we have to take that thing out before Hammer can land. Of course. Understood. If there's no Change one else plan, left, people. who else would do it? We're gonna take out that Hades cannon. How do we do that? 
That down shuttle would have been carrying heavy weapons. Perfect. You heard the man. Once we're clear, make your way to the crashed shuttle. We'll search the wreckage for heavy weapons. Right behind you, Shepard. Oh my god. Oh no, I am... I have the wrong weapon right now. Actually, you know what? It might be just the right one. Not extremely damagey. Okay, where's my mouse? <laughs> Alright, uh, you got this, and you got that, and I have this. Damn, I can't stay here, man. Get clear. Come get us once you're taking that turret out. Woo wee! Oh god. Okay. All right, this is not the class for this weapon. <laughs> Ooh wee! Okay, 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 okay. Let's start. Sh stop shaking. Excuse me. My god, there's the Marauder. Alright, we can't reach him, I don't think. We can reach this guy, though. Whew. Maybe I can do a different class besides the Sniper. <laughs> Oh, if everything just stopped shaking. There you are. I got you now. Bitch. Oh my god. Alright, you know what? I'm switching. <laughs> this is fun. And really, really fun. But I do prefer my one-shot kills when I can get them. Can't get you, though. Alright. Pop up now, would you? Oh god. Oh, Jesus. Right. Come on. On cooldown. Alright. There's a big one. Coming in. Okay. Ah. Alright, Marauder. Cannibal? Where are you at? This is Captain Johnson. Uh, let's switch back. Okay. We do. Of course we do. Uh, missed him! Because of course... That is a brute, not a marauder. Thank you very much. That's a brute. Okay. Can't get him like this. Oh, good god. A 
Okay, we can do this. I think he's dead. You're dead. I am not dead. <laughs> If this is time, I'm screwed, by the way. He can't see him, but maybe. Shut up, cannibal. Oh. All right. Nope, we're still fine. Where are you? There you are, though. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. good. Oh, please. Ah! Okay, you know what? I need to creep closer. As ammo. All right, can do that. We are not clear yet. Robber, where are you at? You're facing the wrong way, dude. Are we clear? For now. Alright. Mouse. Clear for now. I see this. Here. Whoa! Cannibal! Oh my god! Jesus! More? Above? Oh, okay, she's dead. That's not unexpected. Okay. Okay, I can live with this. Damon, you got airborne hostiles inbound. Gonna try to keep them off you. Ammo full. Airborne hostiles? That's not good. Also, where are we going? This way. You sure? But I won't be picking you up. I gotta land this bird quick. Get Ooh. safe. Okay. For you. Okay. Switch back to you then. Oh, that's the wrong side. For this. now oh they're coming from behind too that's lovely where though oh not behind got it okay just down the line a sniper keep an eye out for their heavy weapon supplies oh my gosh oh my gosh this is insanity
Complete and total insanity. Oh, no, 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 no. No friendly fire, please. Oh, yes. You little fuckers. Okay. Okay, I am liking this weapon. It's not truly for me, but I like it. Swarmer? I don't even see him. Ah, there you are. Okay. That explains a lot. Okay, we are alive. That is good. What is that? <gasps> Ooh. That's it. We need to open fire. Did it work? Holy shit! <gasps> oh my god. Oh my teams. god. <laughs> Anybody, come in. We need extraction. Oh no! Heads up, we got company. Survive, huh? Oh god. Ah! You know what? Maybe I should have kept the cane. I need to heal or wait. Yaris is down. Is there a banshee right next to me? No, okay. She's just close enough. One behind. Okay. I think. Oh god. I will not survive. Alright, are they alive? Yes. No ammo. Gotcha. Oh, she is right here. Oh my god. Dead. Reload. Banshee, you know what? You need to die. Please. One more. One more. 
Nope. Okay. Still no ammo on this one. Garrus is alive. Really? Oh my god. He can see me. You'll cover me. Hurry, we're taking fire. I'm also taking fire. <laughs> oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Don't you dare. Get us out of here, Corporal. You okay? <sighs> I'm alive. That you are, Commander. Anderson. Anderson. Oh I my God, Anderson. Down, it's good to see you. And you a sight for sore eyes. <laughs> How are we looking? Now that the heavy air Awful. defenses are dealt with, American land, and not a moment too soon. What's left of the resistance is holding a forward operating base, but the Reapers are countering already. Once we regroup, it's going to be up to Hammer to take up the fight. Oh, that was. That was one hell of a fight. <laughs> it must have been brutal here. Cut off from the rest of the Alliance. It's been touch and go from day one. But once we figured out the Reapers were focusing on the major centers, it became easier to avoid direct contact. Until London. Yeah. We held back as long as we could. Sending in recon teams. Lost a lot of good men planning this attack. But with soldiers like Major Coates, and knowing you'd bring us help, we held on. Oh, that's amazing. Without you and your resistance, we'd be dead in the water. Yeah, the Admiral's being modest. He's the reason any of us are still alive. Let's not start handing out medals just yet. This fight's just getting started. And Hammer better be ready for it. <sighs> We're ready. We've been... Getting ready this whole time. They didn't start out together, but they're ready to stand side by side and win this war. Good. That's what it's gonna take. We'll get it done, Anderson. I was born in London. Really? The entire galaxy united. Too bad it took the Reapers to bring us together. No Shepherd's kidding. the one that brought them together. That's exactly what I meant. I know you didn't like leaving, Shepard. But nobody could have accomplished what you've done. It's good to be back home. There's the FOB. Looks good. Give Hammer the all clear. This is horrible. And uh, that looks like our destination from the hologram that they showed me. Admiral, we've set up a command center in the building over there. Looks like we've still got troops coming in. Yes, sir, but not as many as we'd hoped. Hmm. 
Come see me when you're ready, Shepard. Will do. <sighs> He's right. I expected to see more of Hammer here by now. They probably got A shut lot of down. Them won't be making it. You two go on ahead. I'll catch up. The fighting here has been some of the worst on the planet. It looks bad, but there's still hope. And you're here. It'll do the troops good to see you. Bolster their resolve. I can see that, especially considering... So, you guys didn't see that, but I read an email from uh, Alice, and she was talking about basically this specific thing, how there's so many messages from everyone who can possibly message about Shepard or asking Shepard to come save their specific planet, their specific colony, this and that, so... I would imagine some people from this group also sent those messages, so... It would be good to see them. I'm just a soldier like them. You might see yourself like that, but they don't. Like it or not, Commander, you're a hero to these men and women. Don't discount the effect that can have on them. I better go meet up with my battalion. I'll see you at the command center. Oh, we. This is nuts. Okay, what can we do in here? Can I pick up some medkits? Because I used up quite a bit and I imagine I would be using more. No? Thank you, finally. Is there a map of this place? No. Ugh. What are you- how are you shooting through this? That's impressive, but... How? <laughs> Maybe it opens up part way or something? Hey, James! Hey, what, no Lola? <laughs> yeah, sorry. You okay? I don't know what I thought I'd feel coming back to Earth. I was ready to fight. Ready to die if I had to. But seeing everything like this. Wow. Even his voice is different. Did you guys notice? <laughs> we will rebuild. I know it's hard to say. But this is only temporary. But first we need to win this thing. Stay focused. Don't let them take your will to fight. I know. I know. You're right. So... I guess this is it, no? One more push. One last fight. Not necessarily our last. It's been an honor serving with you, Shepard. You're a good man and a terrific soldier. Thanks. Whatever happens out there today, I know you'll make me proud. That means a lot to me, ma'am. Good luck out there, Lola. This definitely looks like what they showed us in the hologram. Did these guys talk? <laughs> they do not. That's okay. Who else am I gonna see here? What did they find? Did Echo Team have a recommendation? Affirmative. Advise delaying next wave of hammer. Oh. Damn. We get murdered out there. We don't have a choice. Negative on that delay. We'll advise command of the situation, but hammer proceeds as planned. Over. Acknowledged. Okay. We have word from the other outposts. Airfield reports 80% KIA. Camden, 75% KIA. Uh. Repeat your last. Say again. Kensington reports 100% killed in action. 
All of them. About time Mission SOS reported that they were being overrun by enemy forces. No word since. All personnel presumed dead. Shit. Thompson and Dewhurst were posted there. Maybe they got out. We don't know for sure. We'll advise if more intel becomes available. Oh. It's nice to see Makos. Hey, Caden. Hey, Shepard. You ready? Absolutely. For anything. Bring it on. And Biotics Division? Your students? <laughs> More than ready. Eager. That's youth for you. Guess we're old soldiers. Hey, Shepard. Yeah. I guess we are. We know the score. We know this is goodbye. I agree, but I hope. We're gonna win this thing. Don't get me wrong. I'm gonna fight like hell to see you on the other side. But listen, I... There's... Things I wanna say. And looking back, I have a few regrets, but not many. That's pretty damn amazing, right? Messed up kid that I was. Never would have dreamed of the life I've had. And I owe a lot of that to you, you know? It's been quite a ride. It sure has. But how are you doing? Scared? Yeah. Damn straight I'm scared. But that fear is gonna keep me alive long enough to strike these bastards right through the heart. Yeah. Exactly. So... Take care, Major. You too, Commander. Well... I should find the rest of my squad. Yeah. You know... I've never been to London. I knew. <laughs> oh... So we're gonna see all of them, probably. Yes, Commander. Is there someone you'd like to reach? Grunt? Yes, please. Grunt. Certainly. I'll connect you now. About time you got here, Shepard. Didn't want to win this thing all by myself. Good to see you back in action, Grunt. Wouldn't miss it. Shepard. Yeah? Thanks. For getting me out of that tank. Sure, Grunt. It's been an honor. Same here, Shepard. Okay. Grunt out. Commander. Hope you don't mind me crashing this little party of yours. <laughs> Not at all. Feeling better? Much. I got a few sideways looks from Alliance Brass when I offered to help. They can't be choosy at this point. I'm glad you made it. Shepard. I wanted to say goodbye. Goodbye? If we both come back from this at all, everything will be different. Sure, everything will change, but on our terms. We've been running until now, Miranda. It has to stop. I understand. This isn't goodbye. You have to believe we're not done yet. Listening to you, I can believe it. Good. And Miranda, Yes? Be careful. I promise. And you too, Shepard. Shepard, that you? Jacob, holding up? <laughs> Kicking ass more like. My kill count's through the roof. We'll meet and compare notches when this is over. You got it. There's this, uh, great little bar in Rio. We have to check out. I'm holding you to that. Give him hell, Jacob. Yes, sir. Shepard out. This is a goodbye, isn't it? Is there someone else I can connect you to? Oh my god. Yes, all of them. Please, let's go. Zaid Masani. Certainly. I'll connect you now. 
Almost thought you weren't gonna make it, Shepard. Glad I was wrong. You doing okay, Zaid? Yeah, yeah. Hope you've got one hell of a speech to get everyone moving. <laughs> Looks like we might need it. Never seen anything like this. We don't stop it now, it gets worse. No kidding. Just doesn't feel like a real ground war when your opponents are taller than goddamn skyscrapers. Still, no use talking about it. Ready to go when you are. Let's cut the bastards. Steve Cortez. Certainly. I'll connect you now. I hope he's okay. Commander, you made it. Glad I can say the same about you, Cortez. I've come too far to lose my pilot now. I apologize for that. Things got too hot. Thought maybe I could do another run and head back around. Well, not one of my finer moments. If I'd been flying my old trident, things might have been different. What matters is we took out that AA gun. Absolutely. And the Reapers are next. That's the idea. It'll happen. I'm just glad I could play a part. And Commander, thanks for making me believe again. If you hadn't... It helps to have reason to live again. Stay sharp, Cortez. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Shep. You ready down there? It depends on whether you've got the Crucible good to go. Always ready. No idea what it'll do exactly, but it's gonna be big. Good luck, Shepard. If you live through it, drinks are on me. Okay. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Now I understand that piece of dialogue from before when I was questioning it. They said crucible to the citadel. I was thinking they said catalyst for whatever reason, and I don't didn't understand it, but now it all makes complete sense. Jack. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Shepard? Shepard, is that you? Yes. Jack, how are you guys? Good so far. We're a ways south of your position. We saved some resistance fighters with barrier support. Bring a bit more firepower your way. Good. I'll see you on the other side. Good, good, good. I'll let you down, Shepard. Go kick some ass. You too. The ass will be kicked. There's someone else I can connect you to? Samara. Certainly. I'll connect you now. I'm glad you made it, Samara. The honor is mine, my friend. You helped me a great deal in the monastery, Shepard. Thank you for returning the favor. Only your actions will be remembered. May you choose them well. Farewell. I hope I will. Is there else I can connect you to? I'm done. No. Yes, ma'am. We are done talking at this point. Let's see who else we can spot. Anderson is there. But maybe here? I'm impressed that sprinklers are still running, honestly. You see them? <laughs> okay. I want you to coordinate with the Alliance. Make sure we iron out these logistical problems. Yes, sir. The Krogan don't want to share supplies, though. That's just Rex playing hard to get. Tell him I've got a crate of Denorian beer I'd be happy to barter with. <laughs> and that ought to get his attention. Shepard. So, I guess this is... Just like old times. Huh. huh. Might be the last chance we get to say that. You think we're gonna lose? No, I think we're about to kick the Reapers back into whatever black hole they crawled out of. Then we're going to retire somewhere warm and tropical and live off the royalties from the vids. Maybe even find out what a Turian human baby looks like. Does that even work? <laughs> I'm game. Though I think adoption is a better idea. Biology may That's not what I'm operate. saying. Huh. I suppose there will be a lot of little Krogan around. So. <sighs> we just have to beat the Reapers first. Well, adopt James a grunt. Told me there's an old saying here on Earth. May you be in heaven half an hour before the devil knows you're dead. Not sure if Torian heaven is the same as yours, but 
this thing goes sideways and we both end up there. Meet me at the bar. I'm by. <laughs> We're a team, Garrus. There's no Shepard without Vicarian. So you better remember to duck. Sorry, Turians don't know how. But I'll improvise. And Shepard, forgive the insubordination, but your boyfriend has an order for you. Come back alive. It'd be an awfully empty galaxy without you. Goodbye, Garrus. And if I'm up there in that bar and you're not, I'll be looking down. You'll never be alone. All right, I took a few minute break here for understandable reasons. So, oh, Primark is here. Primark Victus, I didn't realize you were here. I wanted to return the favor in person, though I'm sorry to see your world looks as bad as ours. Yeah. I'm yep. surprised you're not back on Palavan. This war will be won or lost today, here, on Earth, not Palavan. Everything comes down to this moment, and history will record that the Turian hierarchy stood among the brave. How are things back on Palavan? Heard not Rex was true to his word. Of the course. Kogan put up a magnificent fight, fearless to the last soldier. They bought us time to evacuate civilians. Yet even then, the Reapers were still too much. The only hope from my world now is victory here on Earth. I'm glad we got this chance to speak. Good luck, Commander. I am also glad that the Catalyst and the Crucible, well, at least the Crucible, kind of ended up what we were hoping it would be. Oh, We do. Get on that gun. Holy shit. No. You you Stop that. Ooh. You all die today, not us. Oh my god. What is this? What was that? What was that? Did someone make it in or out? Okay. Is there anyone else that we can talk to? Around here. I'm afraid to open this. No, okay, good. We're not at Anderson yet. How are the casualties? They haven't brought in many more wounded. That's something. Except they're all are dead. Are you holding up, Liara? This is it, isn't it? Yeah. This is it. I don't know what to say. I just know I'll have a clever line five minutes from now. I do have one thing for you, Shepard. A gift. It'll only take a moment, if you want it. Yeah, what is it? What kind of gift? Do you remember when I first joined my consciousness to yours? I can show you some of my own memories. Asari exchange them sometimes, with their friends or the people they respect. 
It can also be a way to say farewell. I would like that. I'd be honored. Close your eyes. Hopefully it's better than the dream that we've been having constantly. <laughs> Do what needs to be done, Shepard. Where is Tali? I wonder. What's his condition? Amazing. There's a lot of blood. His leg was blown off by the knee. Okay, and I'll try to stay calm. I'm just a civilian. We're out of Medidale, and your surgeon got killed by a reaper. I don't know how to do this. I'll talk you through it. You're his only hope right now. The most important thing is to stop the bleeding. How? Do you have Tourniquet. any towels or bandages? No, nothing. We're sitting under a bombed out highway. Then use your shirt. Tear off one of your sleeves and... Wait, something's coming our way. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. It's passing by. You need to tear off your sleeve into strips. You're going to make a tourniquet. All right. Just above his knee to cut off the blood flow. Tie it off in a knot. I'm trying. Okay? Around his knee. I can't get it tight enough. There's so much blood. Try it again. Pull tighter. You need a stick. Okay. I'm wrapping it again. You need a stick to, you know, turn it to tighten it. I think I got it. What's his condition? That's good. Stay with him. If the bleeding starts again, let me know. You're going to make it. Right. Okay. Thank you. But I don't think we'll survive another night of this. Hopefully, we can make it without another day passing. Oh, what is this? Medkit. Oh, should I not be taking these because they're using them? Can I see how many I have? Seven. Okay. We don't need any more. Sammy, where are you? Can't find you. Message me back, please. People go into that place and come out not the same, not human anymore. Can't hear the voices crawling inside the back of my skull, whispering. They won't. <sighs> they won't stop. Why won't it stop? Until I go where the others went to get turned into one of those things. Oh god, please, make it stop. Make it stop. Won't listen to the voices. Won't go in there. Can make it stop. Know what to do. Oh no. I think I know what happens. Yep. Doctor? Yes, I'm here. The corporal stopped breathing. <gasps> do you feel a pulse? You did everything you could. We'll get you out of there soon. I don't think so. One of the big reapers is coming our way. Well, then run, get out of there. That doesn't work. They always catch you. And then they turn you into things. You have to try. Go! No. I've got the corporal's gun here. I'm going to end it before they find me. Ernest? You mean... No, 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 don't! No! Are you still there? Hello? Are you there? Damn it. Just like that tablet! Javik! 
thousand years ago. When all seemed lost and the end was near, one word delivered the killer blow. One word beat the monsters back to the abyss. And one word brought death to an enemy none dared to fight. That word was Kroger! And today, the Krogan rise again. Today, we forge a new path and join the galaxy as allies in victory. Today, we win our future! <laughs> Shepard, you did it. No matter what else happens today, you did what no one else could. You united a galaxy. That's a victory right there. And don't worry. I know why you're going to win. Because you brought the Krogan. Oh, and Makara sent her regards. She's already pregnant. There are benefits to being a clan leader. But she <laughs> keeps insisting we name the first one Morden. Anyway, let's get to it. I meant to tell you, Shepard. Earth reminds me of home. Guess you'll be needing a new planet, too. That's okay. Nuchanka's got room to spare. And a guard dog named Kalros. Nuchanka's got room to spare for now. We're ready, Shepard. Say the word. Okay, did I miss Tally somewhere? I'm going to run around and see if I can spot her, if I can reach her or something. So I'll meet you guys at Javik in a few seconds for you. Well, it turns out I can't go back, so... Hello, Javik. Commander. Was it this bad in your time? Worse. Worse? I've been listening to the Krogan speak to his men. In our cycle, the races never came together. There was no rallying cry. I envy you. Really? There's not much left out there. The future is still out there. It is something my people could never say. There will be a tomorrow. Only if we win today. No one else has ever made it this far. Yeah, didn't they? They were at it for... A long time. You came a long way, Javik. Further than anyone else here. And I look forward to fulfilling my mission. But you are now the avatar of this cycle. The exemplar of victory. Not just for humanity, or Turians, or Protheans, but for all life. Every soul that has ever existed is watching this moment. Well, no pressure when you put it that way. Do not waver. Victory is never won without difficult choices. We can do this. I know. But to make a lot of those. We can do this. There may be more. But I know you will see this through for all of us, no matter the cost. Ah! If God. we actually pull this off, what will you do afterwards? Seeing the past again in the Echo Shard. The faces of my men. I will go to the Cronian Nebula, and I will find their graves. I will put their ghosts to rest, and then I will join them. You mean... It is as it should be, Commander. The last Protean voice has spoken. There is no more left to say. Here. This shard is now yours. Add to it. The progeny of this cycle will study it. They will know this was the day when the Reapers were no more, and that you were their conqueror. You know, I understand him. I think it w if I was in his situation, the last person of my entire people, not even just race, species, yes, species, I think is the word that I was looking for. I, I don't know what I would be doing. It's a lonely existence. So. He probably should not have listened to it, and I know I pushed him to it, but I understand. What about this, though? Tally. We could circle around and flood it with reinforcements. Name me one place in this city that isn't. 
Did I hear Zaid? No, Coats. We have to make do with what we've got, Major. Get their crews prepped and moving. Yes, sir. Oh. Almost time for the final push. Are you okay? Mm -mm. I thought I'd be asking you that question. Shepard, I backed you when I was just a kid on her pilgrimage. I backed you when the Normandy was a Cerberus ship. What kind of friend would I be if I didn't back you now? And you haven't answered my question. Are you okay? No. No. Remember how you felt when you landed on Rannoch? Now imagine it's not a story passed down by your people. Imagine you were there just a few months ago. And now you're seeing it like this. We need to put it right. We will. Whatever happens, I'm proud to have served with you, Captain. It's, it's been an honor, Talizor of us, Normandy. The Admirals once hung that ship name on me like a badge of shame. And then the Normandy helped us reclaim our homeworld. It's time I returned the favor. Yeah, take that, Admirals. <laughs> Shepard, I have a question. Yeah? Is it a big or small one? It is important. Its relevance would be diminished at any other time. Ask away. In this battle, the Reapers have no reason not to use their full capabilities to destroy us. Their forces are in entrenched positions. They have superior firepower and outnumber our forces. My question is, what makes you think we can reach the Conduit at all? I... Personally, if that question was asked of me, um, I think I would say that the alternative would be just sitting there and waiting for the resolution. Uh, ergo, being indoctrinated and, uh, I guess, harvested. So, this is the only thing I can do, and the only thing I can do is try. So that's what we're doing. The Reapers have the Citadel. They think they've won and that's the best time to hit them. If they have spies or other intelligence, we could lose the element of surprise. In such a case, we will likely lose. Are you afraid? Our probability for success is greater than any other plan presented to date. That's not what I asked. Are you afraid? I do not understand the purpose of the question. There's no room for doubt anymore, Edie. You understand what we have to do or you don't. I am clear on what we must accomplish, Shepard. The Reapers have destroyed thousands of civilizations. But they have never destroyed ours. Nor will they. You can be afraid and still understand what you need to do. Couldn't put it better myself. Time to move out. Shepard, there is something I want you to know. What is it? The elusive man ordered my creation years ago. Jet was the one who allowed me to think for myself. But only now do I feel alive. That is your influence. Thanks, Edie. It seems strangely significant. Commander? Admiral? Just going over the sit rep. How's it look? Barely 50% of Hammer has reported in. Can we count on more making it? There's some stragglers still en route. But the bulk of Hammer that's still intact has arrived. Oof. We're as ready as we're likely to get. I'm almost ready. Let's start. I think I'm ready. Every minute wasted here, the Reapers gather strength. I didn't exactly mean to be that aggressive. Battalion leaders, report to HQ. We fought hard to get here, but now the toughest part of our mission begins. We've got to drive right through the heart of Reaper-controlled territory, break past their defenses, 
and get to that beam. Yep, that was it. What kind of defenses? The that entire was the area is crawling with Reaper forces. But our biggest concern is the destroyer, protecting the beam itself. Can we bring in air support to deal with it? Negative. Some kind of interference. We'll have to take it out from the ground. Now they've cut a swath of no man's land through the city. We'll have to cross that first. There'll be some limited shelter on the other side, but expect heavy ground resistance. We need to get our tanks to here. If we get close enough, we've got a shot of taking that thing out. How much of a shot? They know we're coming. This will be a one-way trip for many of us, but there can be no retreat, no stepping back. We move forward at all costs, understood? Yeah! Yes, sir! Johnson, Coates, you two will coordinate the artillery units. Can we take the Makos? They have a Shepherd, nice artillery I'm on you them. Right up the gut where the resistance is heaviest. Support the tanks the best you can, but stay alive. I need you for the final push to the beam. I'll give you a minute with your squad. Pick your team well. Comrades. <laughs> this war has brought us pain and suffering and loss. But it's also brought us together as soldiers, allies, friends. This bond that ties us together is something the Reapers will never understand. It's more powerful than any weapon, stronger than any ship. It can't be taken or destroyed. The next few hours will decide the fate of everyone in the galaxy. Every mother. Every son. Every unborn child. Every little Krogan. They're trusting you. Depending on you to win them their future. A future free from the threat of the Reapers. But take heart. Look around you. You're not in this fight alone. We face our enemy together. And together, we will defeat them. Here's to hope. Oh, now who do we take with us, is what I wonder. I... Still tempted to stick with my usual suspects. But Liara is not very tanky. Garrus is better. But Liara has a lot of cards up her sleeve that she can use. On the other hand, we have Javik, who is pretty good and fairly tanky. And his particle rifle is nice. Edie and Tali are somewhat similar. Oh. Okay, maybe it's it's quite possible that we'll have to try it several times, so maybe I'll try my favorites and then we can see if other choices are better. We're good on this. <laughs> we are taking the Makos.
and to think that they are probably shooting at their former civilians or colleagues. It's so brutal. A jerk. Oh. And you are dead. Okay, I don't have my ammos. They do, though. They're smarter than me. All clear. Okay, which way are we heading? November, forward. forward. <laughs> Stay alive. For now. <gasps> no! You bastards. Okay, we'll talk about this. Come on. Okay, um... You are dead. There's one more. Or are you? Oh, not one more. Okay, never mind. Where are you? There is another. Where's you? You're dead. You are still here somehow. Where? You've glitched? Okay. <sighs> Alright, slowly but surely. They can. Okay, okay, we can do this. Okay. Come on now. Oh, okay. I, I think I got it. I need to change position. That was not the best position. Oh, 
my tank. You are not doing well. Is he is he being attacked by who? Yep, they're down. They're banshee. Oh my god. Where are you? No, he just left. Oh, he is almost dead. Yes. You jerk. Oh, bad spot, bad spot, bad spot. Very bad spot. Ah! Okay. Not good. Not good. Oh, I'm gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> oh, lordy. Yep, the tank is dead. Ay, ay. Is he. Did he just explode? Is that what happened? I think so. I think I see the pieces. That's cool. Except now we have the Banshee. Screw you, lady. Retreat. Oh, I can't even see you. Is that you? It is you. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Don't st stop shaking. Okay, we can do this again. She dead. Taking heavy fire from the second story. Request assistance. We'll try Is there another one? I clear the building. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Screw you. Okay. Oh my goodness. Can we save? Thank you. Hooey. Foxtrot and Bravo are taking heavy fire. Yeah, they would be. Can you take care of this? Thank you. Is there... What is this? What am I seeing? There's a husk. I... Oh, I guess it's not there anymore. <laughs> Alright, Garrus. Do it again. Thank you. I think I should switch. Oh, a brute! Of course there's a brute.
Can we get the brute? Yes. I should probably get out of here. Oh, this isn't good. This is not good at all. Okay. No ammo, of course. There's another one. I need to do this. Ah, there's the brute. Brute is done. Yes. Okay, we're done. I think so. Oh, okay. Overheated. There we go. That's much better. I could live with that. Coming. Coming. Damn it. Kale company's being rooted. Oh. 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 Shit. Shields. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Can't. Can't have that. Can't have that. Oh, my God. One guy. Thank you. Thank, thank you. For surviving. Ooh, what is that? Can I afford to get distracted? Oh wait, this is the only door. Okay. More medical stuff. This way. Okay, Marauder. We're gonna get ya. Dickhead. Okay, this thing is pretty deadly. I like it. I don't particularly appreciate the um, the lack of accuracy, but it kind of makes up for it. Except I'm an idiot and I did not have the right ammo selected, or any, for that matter. It might be a better option for, to go for this one. I have ammo on this one, yeah. Good. Uh, for a second there, it looked like there was someone invisible. Oh. 
you a jerk. One more. Good. Let's switch now. This is Echo Company. There's not enough room to maneuver the tanks in here. Backtrack if you have to. I'll find enough room to do <gasps> that is a fairly good way to deal with marauders. No, Ravagers. Maybe even Brutes. Except now it's got no ammo. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. I hear you. Where are you? Nope. Oh. Actually, let's switch again. So we can have a chance to recharge. There you are. Is there more? Okay. We're alive. For now. And some people are too. Thanix. Oh my god. You are joking me. Can we get that guy? Explode the shit out of him. Okay. Ooh, hello now. Thank you for showing up to the party. I think he glitched. He did not glitch. <laughs> he did not glitch at all. We are alive. Temporarily. <sighs> Good for now. Wait, there's more. I sound like an infomercial. There's more. There is more. There he is. And he is here. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Pick up some of those ammos. Wait. Are we- no, we're not going up. Okay. Can't even save! I wish. Oh, down we go. You won't do anything but piss it off. Where is the best spot for this? He 
You are shooting at me, aren't you? Okay. Okay, we are alive. For now. I appreciate the pause com combat, and I know a lot of you guys don't like that I do it, but it gives me a chance to recharge and reassess. Because I get easily overwhelmed. Get fu- One more. Okay, full. We're good. We're good. That is not a welcome situation. <sighs> My god. I... Everyone's gonna die. There's more! This is insanity. Okay. Okay. Marauder, sir. Hit it with everything we've got. All right, ladies and gentlemen, take care of your situations here. Where is he coming from? Down here? Screw you! Okay... This is the way? This corridor? With nowhere to hide? Amazing! I need to get away! I need to get away. We all do, actually. Wait. Security memo. They're targeting shelters, evacuation shuttles, emergency services, power centers, people. It's not about destroying property as much as it's about destroying the population. We've got to modify standard evac plans. We can't rely on conventional procedures. We'll just get more people killed. Stay in small groups, get survivors out of the city, spread people out as much as possible. That's the word, people. 
that's a good plan. If this is going to be another one of those ambushes with a bunch of... guys... Can we get another one of those... Um, nuclear bombs? Okay, Marauder. There's the artillery. Get fucked. <laughs> this is like my motto for this. But the company's been wiped out. Commander, do you read me? Can I do this? Major, what's the situation? The beam's interfering with missile guidance. We can hit the destroyer, but we'll never make the precision strike we need to take it out. Okay. Damn it. Edie, can you read me? Yes, Commander. Any suggestions? I may be able to use the Normandy systems to enhance the missile's targeting capabilities. Excellent. I'll need you to open a link to the Normandy from the missile systems. Yes. On it. We can do this. It's here. That's it. I'll let you know when I've adapted the targeting systems. Sounds like good news, Commander. We'll see. Never. This is Admiral Anderson. Oh god. Okay. You heard him, people. Get ready. There they are. Good god. Wait, you are flying, but you are dead. You are about to fly. God damn that recoil sometimes. Okay. We can do this. I cannot even hear. Who- oh, got it. Who's shooting at me now? There you are. I cannot see you very well. Oh my god. All sides. Okay, let's do this. I need to take out that marauder. Where are you? Oh, whoops. Sorry. Sorry. Commander, we tried to hold them off, but they destroyed our trucks, overwhelmed our position. Oh, no. Your left flank is gone. They're headed your way. Of course. Sorry, sir. Hang in there, soldier. That's all right. Heads up. We got more incoming. That's all right. We can do this. Wait, where is more? 
can't even see. Okay, reload. Bane she! That bitch! Oh my god! I did not hit her. Okay, okay, we can do this. Priority Banshee. Okay, we can hit you. You stop where you are. Dead is what you are. Is there more? Oh! This is insane. Nope, didn't get him. Didn't get him in the slightest. Oh, Banshee. How oh, I am tired of your kind. I swear to god, she just spawned again when I killed her. Guys, retreat. Retreat. Everything is shaking. Nope. I'll hit you again, you- Oh... My god. Okay. Okay. Let's reassess and regroup. Liara is dead. We can fix this. You fix that. Who's dead now? No one? Is there another Banshee? Please don't tell me that. Are we alive? I've reprogrammed targeting. Missiles are ready for launch. Okay, let's do it. Got it. You heard her. Back to the truck, people. Missile guidance enhanced. Firing! Please? Countering interference. Did it hit? One? I think what it happened? did. The Reaper is still too close to the beam. What? It needs to move? Missiles. And we haven't even made a dent. You will need to allow the Reaper to move out of the beam's influence. And closer to us. Commander, hammer's being overrun at every turn. Reaper ground forces are converging on your location. Ah. Uh... We're on our way to you. Hold on, Commander. Hold on. We are alone. These more are coming. Hold on, everyone. We can do this. I don't know. We're about to find out. Here they come. From where? Okay, this side. Oh, this is a bad spot. Okay. 
okay, 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 okay. Woo! That's another one. Okay. I need to run. Oh my god. Three. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Okay, we need to concentrate. There's one. Over there. Too close. Too close. Too close. Oh, oh god. Wrong button! Ugh. Okay, you. I am dead. I am so dead! Oh god. Seriously. They just zone in on me like nothing. Is there another one? There's two. Harvester. That's just what I want to hear. Okay. Last one. I'm gonna die too. Where is he? Okay, you know what? Jesus Christ. We done. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is he close enough? Can we try this now? Oh no. We are so dead. I need healing. I can't keep doing this. Oh. I am so dead. No. God damn it. Stupid controls.
What did I see? Thank you. Okay. Roger that, Edie. We can do this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys. Please help me. Must didn't make it. <laughs> We're on our way to your location. Roger. Please, please come. <laughs> Shepard, over here. Thank God you made it. Yeah. It didn't look good. Thank Mitty Gels. Oh. <sighs> it gets worse. Thanks. Of course it does. Packard, just so many thanks. Several Sovereign Class Reapers, including Harbinger, have broken off from the battle with Sword. They're headed here. Harbinger? It's an opportunity for Hackett to get the Crucible in place. But we have to get a team on board the Citadel to open those arms now. We still okay. don't even know what we'll find when we get to the Citadel. No. And that's our job. Find out what we're up against. All right. Saddle up, everybody. We don't know what we'll find, but we do know that it is capable to deal with Reapers, at least. So we have that. <sighs> oh my god. We are so close to this thing. We gotta make it. Those Makos are gonna have one hell of a time with that terrain. <laughs> can't destroy the crucible this is our last hope whatever we find on the citadel Hammer and sword, huh? That's what we have. From here on in, it's a straight shot to the beat. A straight shot with Reapers trying to crush <laughs> us along the way. We just need to get a handful of troops through. That all? We knew this was going to be a gamble at best. I am proud of all of you. Can't think of anyone else I'd rather do this with. I'm honored to be part of your team. We're in sight of the target. All right, everyone. This is it. This is it. Oh, no. Of course. Of course we get hit. By what, Shit. though? Another Reaper? Oh, my God. We are so close. Of course it's another Reaper. <laughs> is that Harbinger? Oh, 
Okay. Okay. We have to reach it, so let's do it. Oh, we can make it. We can make it. Oh no. Oh no. Mid jump. Oh my god. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Please. Guys, survive. please at least Liara can move you gotta get out of here and you've got to be kidding me don't argue Garrus <laughs> we're in this to the end oh no matter what happens here you know I love you I always will Shepard Move! Go! Move out! Okay. 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 Don't you shoot it down. Did I not make it? They're all gone. What? Did we get anyone to the beam? Negative. Our entire force was decimated. Holy shit. It's too much. We need to regroup. Fall back to the buildings. Shepherd. Shepard, please! I can't- I can barely move! Oh god. I don't have any powers. I don't have any guns. Oh no. Don't run on corpses. He's still alive. Was alive. One last marauder to get to me. Oh, Shepard, please make it. Make it. <sighs> 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 
ai, ai. It's coming. It's coming. Keeper? What are you doing? Ouch! Shepard. <laughs> Shepard. <sighs> How are they talking? Is she hallucinating? You up here too. Oh, she's hallucinating. I followed you up, but we didn't come out the same place. No, at least I don't think we did. What's your surrounding look like? Corpses. <laughs> <You okay? laughs> I feel like death. But I'm moving. I might be dead, honestly. It's dark. There's or heavily hallucinating. Sounds familiar. I'm in a dark hallway. Reminds me of your description of the collector base. <sighs> Makes sense. You think they're making a reaper in here? <laughs> sure. They round them up on Earth. And the people appear to be processed. God damn abomination. I'm gonna keep moving. The sooner we blow these bastards back to hell, the better. The tubes don't go on forever. But where the hell are we? Yeah. It doesn't look like any part of the citadel I've been to. Are we even on the citadel? Anderson. What is that? Okay, we can move a little bit. Might be a way to cross over. Don't get too far ahead of me. Where do you think you're at? Just found that chasm you were talking about. What? Anderson? Is he actually here? Sure didn't look like anyone was around me when I was getting to it. Just the Marauder. What in the hell is this? Is that Anderson? It is. Is he okay? Anderson. Shepard. I can't. Is he? I underestimated you, Shepard. Of what? course you're here. I warned you. Control is the means to survival. 
control of the Reapers and of you, if necessary. They're controlling you. I don't think so, Admiral. Controlling me is a lot different than controlling a Reaper. Have a little faith. When humanity discovered the mass relays, when we learned there was more to the galaxy than we imagined, there were some who thought the relays should be destroyed. They were scared of what we'd find, terrified of what we might let in. But look at what humanity has achieved. Since that discovery, we've advanced more than the past 10,000 years combined. And the Reapers will do the same for us again, a thousandfold. But... Uh. Only if we can harness their ability to control. No. Bullshit. We no. destroy them, or they destroy us. And waste this opportunity? Never. You didn't earn this power. Maybe you're just so hungry for power that it's clouded your vision. No. No. It's not that simple. Isn't it? You're willing to give up anything for control. Yes. If not me, then who? Are you going to control the Reapers? There's always another way. I've dedicated my life to understanding the Reapers. And I know with certainty the Crucible will allow me to control them. And then what? Look at the power they wield. Look at what they can do! I killed Anderson. I see what they did to you. I took what I wanted from them, made it my own. This isn't about me or you. It's about things so much bigger than all of us. He's wrong. Don't listen to him. And who will you listen to, Shepard? An old soldier stuck in his ways, only able to see the world down the barrel of a gun? And what if he's wrong? What if controlling the Reapers is the answer? If we destroy the Reapers, this ends today. But if you can't control them... <laughs> but I can! Are you willing to bet humanity's existence on it? I... No, it will work. You can't, can you? They won't let you do it. No! I'm in control! No one is telling me what to do! Listen to yourself! You're indoctrinated! For no. real? No! The two of you so self-righteous! Do you think power like this comes easy? There are sacrifices! You sacrifice too much. You could Shepherd, sacrifice the entire I, I only people. wanted to protect humanity. The Crucibles can control them. I know it can. I just... It's not too late. Let us go. We'll do the rest. He's not going to. I... There's no way. I can't do that, Commander. Of course you can't. They own you now. Don't you, you... dare. You'd undo everything I've accomplished. I won't let that happen. Because of you, humanity is already undone. That's not true! Yes, it they is. They have the Citadel. They've got us fighting each other instead of fighting them. I just need to... You've done exactly what the Reapers wanted. You're still doing it because they control you. I... They're too strong. You're stronger. Don't let them win. Break their home. Don't let them control you. I tried, Shepard. Now you agree. After everything, now you agree. 
Holy. He won. He didn't let them control him to the end. We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. They are opening. Everything is destroyed. It's coming. This is it, everyone. The alarms are opening. Interesting. That's it. The crucible is docked. So now what? Anderson, are you alive? Yes, good. <sighs> good. Commander? We did it. Yes, we did. It's uh, quite a view. <laughs> Best seats in the house. Feels like years since I just sat down. I think you earned a rest. Mm. Mm. Stay with me. We're almost through this. You did good, child. You did good. I'm proud of you. Thank you, sir. Shepard, Commander. I, uh, what do you need me to do? Nothing's happening. The crystal's not firing. Oh no! It's gotta be something on your end. <sighs> Commander Shepard! I don't see. I'm not sure how to. Oh Commander. my god. What? What is happening now? Who has taken us where? <laughs> In a way, the Citadel is now complete. Because that center was always hollow. Why are the Reapers not doing anything? We kept chasing. Wake up. What? Where am I? The Citadel. It's my home.
Who are you? I am the catalyst. I thought the Citadel what? was the catalyst. No, the Citadel is part of me. I need to stop the Reapers. Do you know how I can do that? Perhaps. So this is the AI? Them. They are my solution. The AI that we've been told about then? The solution to what? Chaos. Chaos. The created will always rebel against their creators. But we found a way to stop that from happening. A way to restore order. By wiping out organic life? No, we harvest advanced civilizations, leaving the younger ones alone. Just as we left your people alive the last time we were here. But you killed the rest. We helped them ascend, so they can make way for new life, storing the old life in Reaper form. I think we'd rather keep our own form. No, you can't. Without us to stop it, synthetics would destroy all organics. We've created the cycle so that never happens. That's the solution. Isn't that the same as the created rebellion against the creators? Because this AI guy, AI child, pardon me, ended up destroying whoever created him. It. <sighs> what do you know about the Crucible? The device you refer to as the Crucible is little more than a power source. Oh. However, in combination with the Citadel and the Relays, it is capable of releasing tremendous amounts of energy throughout the galaxy. It is crude, but effective and adaptive in its design. Who designed it? You would not know them, and there is not enough time to explain. We first noted the concept I think I know them. for this device several cycles ago. With each passing cycle, the design has no doubt evolved. Why didn't you stop it? We believe the concept had been eradicated. Clearly, organics are more resourceful than we realized. He's doing the same thing. That he says all AIs would do. That's what I think. Where did the Reapers come from? Did you create them? My creators gave them form. I gave them function. They, in turn, give me purpose. The Reapers are a synthetic representation of my creators. Leviathan. Yes. They created me to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life. To establish a connection. They became the first true Reaper. They did not approve, but it was the only solution. You said that before, but how do the Reapers solve anything? Organics create synthetics to improve their own existence, but those improvements have limits. To exceed those limits, synthetics must be allowed to evolve. They must, by definition, surpass their creators. The result is conflict, destruction, chaos. It is inevitable. Reapers harvest all life, organic and synthetic preserving them before they are forever lost to this conflict. What is the point of this preservation? They don't live anymore. Yes, how is this not conflict? That's my point. We're at war with the Reapers right now. You may be in conflict with the Reapers, but they are not interested in war. <laughs> I find that hard to believe. When fire burns, is it at war? Is it in conflict? Or is it simply doing what it was created to do? We are no different. We harvest your bodies, your knowledge, your creations. We preserve it to be reborn in the form of a new reaper. Like a cleansing fire, we restore balance. No, I don't buy that. New life, both organic and synthetic, can once again flourish. 
You said you're the catalyst, but what are you? A construct. An intelligence designed eons ago to solve a problem. I was created to bring balance, to be the catalyst for peace between organics and synthetics. So you're just an AI? In as much as you are just an animal, I embody the collective intelligence of all Reapers. But you were created. Correct. By who? By ones who recognized that conflict would always arise between synthetics and organics. I was first created to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life, to establish a connection. But our efforts always ended in conflict, so a new solution was required. More conflict. <laughs> the Reapers. Precisely. I met your creators. They told me what you did to them. We did as we were expected. They said you betrayed them, that you turned them into Harbinger. When they asked that I solve the problem of conflict, they failed to understand they were part of the problem themselves. The flaws of their organic reasoning could not perceive this. They lacked the foresight to understand their destruction was part of the very solution they required. Well, they've joined this war now. And I welcome their involvement. I am only facilitating their request. <laughs> Your solution is absolutely flawed. The way I understand this explanation is that, well, the artificial intelligence always surpasses its creators and thus destroys the creators, which is what exactly what he is doing over and over and over. So how is he solving the conflict when he's just facilitating it? But you're taking away our future. Without future, we have no hope. Without hope, we might as well be machines, programmed to do what we're told. You have hope, more than you think. The fact that you were standing here, the first organic ever, proves it. But it also proves my solution won't work anymore. So now what? We find a new solution. We can stop destroying Why the Earth telling me this? while we're talking. Why help me? You have altered the variables. <laughs> what do you mean? The Crucible changed me, created new possibilities. But I can't make them happen. If there is to be a new solution, you must act. It is now in your power to destroy us. But be warned, others will be destroyed as well. The Crucible will not discriminate. All synthetics will be targeted. Even you are partly synthetic. I am, actually. That's true. What exactly will happen? Your crucible device appears to be largely intact. However, the effects of the blast will not be constrained to the Reapers. Technology you rely on will be affected, but those who survive should have little difficulty repairing the damage. There will still be losses, but no more than what has already been lost. Okay. Is he saying that it, it will wipe out all technology? But the Reapers will be destroyed? Yes, but the peace won't last. Soon, your children will create synthetics, and then the chaos will come back. There has to be another way. There is. You could instead use the energy of the Crucible to seize control of the Reapers. No, we're not doing that. So the elusive man was right after all. Yes, but he could never have taken control. Because we already controlled him. But I can? You will die. You will control us, but you will lose everything you have. How would I... Would I become part of the catalyst in that case? 
How can I control the Reapers if I'm dead? Your corporeal form will be dissolved, but your thoughts and even your memories will continue. Your connection to your kind will be lost, though you will remain aware of their existence. Interesting. But the Reapers will obey me? Yes. We will be yours to control and direct as you see fit. I don't want to do this, just to be clear. There is another solution. Oh? Synthesis. And that is? Add your energy to the crucibles. Oh, okay, so in the previous the one I wouldn't do that. will combine all synthetic and organic life into a new framework. A new DNA. Wait, what? I will rewrite everyone? That's an interesting thought. Explain how my energy can be added to the crucible. Your organic energy, the essence of who and what you are, will be broken down and then dispersed. To do what, exactly? The energy of the crucible, released in this way, will alter the matrix of all organic life in the galaxy. Organics seek perfection through technology. Synthetics seek perfection through understanding. Organics will be perfected by integrating fully with synthetic technology. Synthetics, in turn, will finally have full understanding of organics. It is the ideal solution. Now that we know it is possible, it is inevitable we will reach synthesis. Why couldn't you do it sooner? We have tried a similar solution in the past, but it has always failed. But this one Why? Won't? Because the organics were not ready. It is not something that can be forced. You are ready, and you may choose it. Wait a second. It is not something that can be forced, but I will be forcing it on the entire galaxy? How does that work? I don't... I don't know about that. Not that I can hold a quorum right now for everyone to, you know, yay or nay it. I... I don't know. Why not? Synthetics are already part of you. Can you imagine your life without them? No, I'll be dead. And there will be peace? The cycle will end. The Reapers will cease their harvest, and the civilizations preserved in their forms will be connected to all of us. Synthesis is the final evolution of all life. The paths are open, but you have to choose. Okay. So... Wait. I... Okay. I don't want to control them. That I know for sure. So the choice remains between... So that's the control. That's the destruction. And this is synthesis. He said himself that it cannot be forced. How can we go for this? I would like to go for this, but that would contradict his words. I think I think I'm gonna go with destruction. <laughs> to be honest, his entire speech was a contradiction. Because he was trying to avoid the chaos, but he was trying to... Well, he ended up creating the chaos every new cycle. So, what is the point? We might as well just resolve our situation, whether it be destruction when synthetics arise anew or not. Yeah, I- yeah, I'm going with this. We're doing this. We found more strength than us, too. I'm sorry, Edie. 
I'm sorry, Jeff. Wasn't going to survive. Either way. them. They're getting destroyed too, aren't they? Yep. All of them. Oh, we crashed. Okay. Hopefully successfully. I say we, but it's they. 
There's no shepherd anymore. I'll be looking down from the bar. Now we rebuild. The war is over. The Reapers have been defeated. Against all odds, and in the face of the greatest threat this galaxy has ever known, we survived. We suffered many losses. The relays are severely damaged. But not but destroyed? Won. That's good. This victory belongs to each of us. Every man, woman, and child. Every civilization. On every world. take our first steps toward restoring what we lost, we must remember what it took to win. Ooh wee, that's a lot of Krogan. Oh my god! This wasn't a victory by a single fleet, a single army, or even a single species. If this war has taught us anything, it is that we are at our strongest when we work together. And if we can put down our grievances long enough to stop something as powerful as the Reapers, <laughs> imagine what we can achieve now that they are defeated. It will take time, but we can rebuild everything that was destroyed. Our homes, our worlds, our fleets and defenses, all of this, and more. Together, we can build a future greater than any one of us could imagine. I just hope they stay united a as they were. A future paid for by the sacrifices of those who fought and died alongside us. A future that many will never see. Sadly, he didn't get a chance to see the future. Neither did we. And while we still have many challenges ahead of us, we can face them together. Honor those who died to give us that future.
Is he not putting it up? There's no way. There's no way. <laughs> All right, guys. Now that I had a few minutes to cool off and think about it, let's let's talk. So we had three solutions for the problem that existed since game one. And since game one, we were tasked to destroy the Reapers. Which we ended up doing, but not necessarily because that was the target to begin with. Because I feel like it makes sense to accept alternative solutions as they come up. But, in my personal opinion, first of all, I think I already touched on why I don't particularly like the control solution. Because, okay, we can control them now, but what if in the future we can't? And I still don't quite understand how am I supposed to be this kind of nebulous consciousness that is controlling the Reapers without existing. Is it trying to position me as some sort of a, I don't know, a god of something? Which, in that sense, the control will never end because the consciousness will never go anywhere. So you can kind of accept it as a feasible solution, but maybe I just don't understand it enough. Maybe. It's possible. And the other one, synthesis. I personally really like it as an idea, but... The Catalyst said it himself that they can't. it can't be forced. And it essentially is positioning me as the person who is going to be doing the forcing, because the decision is presumably mine, for some reason. I mean, the explanation was that I'm the first organic that made it up there, so that makes me special. But does it make me special enough to make that decision for the entire galaxy? I don't know about that. I would like to try that solution at some point, just to see how it plays out, but it doesn't quite sit right with me after hearing that explanation. But like I said before, I am curious about it, and presumably it will keep all of the technology intact and better, I guess. Um, so I chose the destroy, as you guys all have seen, and I think at this point, and based on all the contradiction that I was hearing, and again, I could be not completely understanding what the Catalyst was implying, but as I was talking through the conversation with the Catalyst, it seemed like his solution was a non-solution to begin with. So the existence of the Reapers did not make sense in the first place. That definitely led me to the thinking like, okay, well, we can destroy them and start over. And when we do get to the synthetics of a certain level of intelligence, we can deal with it. Because it's quite clear that it's possible because we were able to achieve peace between Corians and the Geth. And Geth are those kinds of synthetics that are above, I guess. Uh, organics intelligence, or general organics intelligence. So it's 
possible? Is it difficult? Of course it's difficult. What is not difficult ever in this life? So the destruction is what I went with. Since they showed Edie as I chose that that ending, I'm assuming that Edie is part of what was destroyed. It makes me upset that all of the Geth are probably part of it too. Because they are the AI that started the Korean Geth conflict, so it would make sense for them to be part of what is destroyed. So that makes me sad, especially considering that they finally had peace, supposedly, because we were still in the middle of the war, but they will never see the peace. <laughs> you know, um, I think I lost my train of thought here a little bit, but I was going to say that I think I am happy with how this ended. Um, the other two endings are a bit questionable. In my personal opinion, I I guess maybe with a little explanation and maybe after seeing them it would provide a little bit more clarity, so perhaps I can go for either one of those next time I play. But I think, in my mind at least, probably not for everyone, definitely not for everyone, uh, the destruction ending makes sense. But. I would love to hear uh, from you guys in the comment section about which ending you picked, which ending you think makes the most sense and why. As if you are still listening, you know what my reasoning was be behind picking one over the other, so I would like to hear what you guys were thinking as well. I think that would be really fun to have a discussion around those topics. So yeah. Um, Thank you guys for coming on this epic journey with me. It was epic for me because it was quite long. I kind of view this whole experience as an odyssey through... Well, Space Odyssey, I guess that's what it is. Space Odyssey is a perfect term for this, so... <laughs> Thank you again for um, watching all of these videos of mine and thank you for uh, contributing in the comment section. I really appreciate every one of you and uh, I hope to see you in the next game that I play. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know this was on the longer side, even for me, so hopefully that's okay. But I definitely found myself being unable to stop once I got into the fray of all of the battle for Earth. So it is what it is at this point. Did that all really happen? Yes, but some of the details have been lost in time. It all happened so very long ago. When can I go to the stars? One day, my sweet. What will be there? Anything you can imagine. Our galaxy has billions of stars. Each of those stars could have many worlds. Every world could be home to a different form of life. And every life is a special story of its own. Tell me another story about the shepherd. It's getting late, but okay. One more story. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you're still watching. If you are, thank you again. <laughs> and um, I'll see you in the next one, whatever that next one may be. Goodbye for now.